At bago pa maputol ang komunikasyon sa Tacloban, naka-live report pa kaninang umaga si Atom Arroyo mula mismo sa Tacloban City. Narito report. Sa may pier ng Tacloban at uh, napakalakas na ng hangin pero hindi pa po tumatama ang sentro ng bagyo dito sa bahagi ng uh, Tacloban. Pung Yolanda ay nandito po, no? Dito po sa karagatan at diretso tumutumbok dito sa bahagi ng Leyte. Pung... Learners, I think you have the idea on our lesson for this week. Yes, you got it right. We are going to tackle about typhoon. Before we begin, I am Teacher Mari and welcome to Science A Lesson. To understand the concept of typhoon formation, our objectives for the lesson are explain how typhoon develops, discuss how the typhoon is affected by land masses and bodies of we experienced a typhoon here in the Philippines mostly in the month of June and September. Every year, in August, when we come across a typhoon, we enter the Philippine area of responsibility or PAO. It is according to the Philippine Atmospheric Trade, Physical and Economical Services, Administration, or PAGASA, an agency that monitors the typhoon development. Earlier in the video, Ngunit, kung patuloy ang pagbuo ng makapal na ulap, 
Magdudulot ito ng sunod-sunod na thunderstorm sa atmosphere. Ito na ngayon ang tinatawag na Low Pressure Area o LPA. Kapag ang converging winds o ang pag-akyat ng warm moist air at pag sa cold air ay patuloy na nagaganap, ito ay nagdadagdag sa pagbuo ng makakapal at mabibigat na ulap. Dahil sa galaw at patuloy na pag ng mundo o ang tinatawag na Coriolis Effect, ang area na may low pressure ay magiging tropical depression kung saan patuloy ang pag-akyat ng currents of air, palibot sa gitna ng bagyo at pagbaba ng mabigat na hangin. Dito, mag-uumpisa sa pagbuo ng mata ng bagyo. Ang palibot sa mata ng bagyo ay tinatawag na eye wall kung saan may pinakamalakas na hangin at mapinsalang bahagi ng bagyo. Ang lowest air pressure ng bagyo ay laging matatagpuan. Sa gitna at kalimitan, ito ay mayroong 950 millibars o pababa. Kapag mataas ang air pressure, ibig sabihin ay malakas ang pwersa ng hangin kung saan ito ay matatagpuan sa high wall. Ang pag-ibot ng bagyo ay clockwise sa southern hemisphere at counterclockwise sa northern hemisphere. Now, you have learned the typhoons develop mainly in warm water because of continuous supply of moisture from the ocean. However, typhoons starts losing energy when it moves over cold water. In addition, when typhoon reaches the land, the supply of moisture is cut off. Then, the typhoon dissipates since its strength decreases most especially if the typhoon makes landfall on a mountainous landmass. This is how important the Sheremata Range in the Philippines. This mountain range protects us against strong typhoon and cross to weaken as its landfall to certain area. It affects the wind direction and therefore interrupts the rotation of typhoon and it gets to soil or Let me check if you understand the lesson. For your learning task 1, analyze and give an interpretation about each problem. Write your answers in your answer sheet. Let us now learn the classification of tropical cyclones. Tropical cyclones depend on the wind speed near the center. Cyclones in the tropics are classified as follows. Tropical depression has maximum sustained winds of up to 61 km per hour or kph. Tropical storm will have sustained winds of 62 to 88 km per hour. Severe tropical storm will have sustained winds of 89 to 117 km per hour. Typhoon has wind speeds ranging from 118 to 220 km per hour. And Super Typhoon will have sustained winds of more than 220 km per hour. For learning task 2, study and answer the questions below. Write your answers in your answer sheet. Number 1. What are the different typhoon categories and their relationship?
ba yung bahay namin ngayon? Eh? Yung pati Pesci Rally? Ha? Ah! Eh, kailangan lang din ang halog lang. Oo nga. Ako nga din, hindi nabila ka ng mga kailangan. Kailangan dapat din yung mga sila. Ay, sige. Ako na pa rin mamamalayin. Hindi naman pagkain para hindi naman lalabas. O, sige, sige. Ako yung sabihin. 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 Ako Ipihin mo na lang si Maring Pim kung kailan tayo matutuloy. Pagkatapos na lang siguro ng bagyo ha. O siya si Gababay. Nay, nagpapahalan ko sana kung lumabas. Kasi nagsap po yung kaibigan ko. Sabi rin ba siya yung dapat tulog ako yung lakad na ako. Nakapit ako nga ba? Sabi, hala, labas tayo? Manahimi ka dyan. Ako nga, tayo. Bas, tignan mo. Lags, lags na ko na to. Pakasahalan pa kayo. O kaya hindi yung kapatid mo. Nagbabasa ng libro o di kaya matahal. Thank you.